Hi, I'm Bryce, and welcome to Making Things. And I'm here with Katie, who's going to build something awesome with us. What did you bring? Yeah, so we're going to be making a flapping wing mechanism. Um, and it's basically just like a simple mechanism that uses a set of gears and linkages uh, to make some wings flap up and down. Cool. Let's get started. Yep. So we've got some materials we're going to use. We've got a wood plate with four holes. We've got two gears. These are 40 tooth gears. We've got four popsicle sticks, two short, two long. We've got eight dowels, four short, four long. We've got two straw spacers, and we've got this big pile of plastic backstops. There should be 14 in all. So the first thing we're going to do is flip over our gears, and we're going to take our two long dowels, and we're going to press them into the back of our gear. And it should be a little bit of a tight fit, and you just want to push them in there, kind of like that. And then we're going to test them. So you're going to set your gears together, and you're going to use one to turn the other. And again, these are 40 tooth gears, so there's no ratio up or down, and they should be going at the same speed. But the important thing to notice here is that they're actually spinning in opposite directions. So then we're going to take our little dowel, and we're going to put it in one of the offset holes. And again, these should be a little bit of a tight fit. And then we're just going to drop them into our wood plates. Uh, and we're going to take the first of our plastic backers and just put them on the back to hold them in place. And if you find that your gears are misaligned, you want to just lift one of them up and line them up so that they're kind of going on the same plane. So what we've basically just done is to build our gear mechanism. Um, and this is going to be what drives the linkage and makes our wings flap up and down. So now that we've got this attached, we're going to put on our short popsicle stick. Um, but as you can see, if you just put the short popsicle stick on directly, um, it's actually not a totally flat surface, and there are a lot of places where this can get stuck and kind of bind up. So what we're going to do before we do that is we're going to add a spacer to kind of raise the vertical plane just a little bit and lift that popsicle stick up. So we're going to add our spacer, we're going to drop these popsicle sticks on, and then we're going to put on our third set of plastic backers. Um, and it's going to look something like this. So if you could imagine that this was a set of, of uh, wings, that we're building a set of wings, um, we've got this gear mechanism that drives it. And what we basically just built is the tendon, that kind of part of your arm that links your chest muscle to your arm. Um, and right now we've got this tendon that's not connected to anything. It's just kind of flapping all over the place. And so the next piece that we're going to build is we're going we're gonna to attach the arm and we're going to build the linkage to basically make the shoulder of our wing. So the first thing you're going to do here is take your plastic backstop and just add a plastic backstop to the end of each of your dowels. And you're going to drop them into your wood plates so they look like this. And when you do this, you can see that now these dowels are going to start to limit the range of motion. So now, instead of flopping around in circles, our linkage uh, is going to start to go up and down. Um, and that's going to be really important because that's the whole point of uh, building this linkage mechanism. OK, so let's attach our arm. So we're going to take these long dowels. We're going to add a spacer to each one. So when you're doing this, your popsicle stick has two holes in it. It's got a hole in the middle and a hole at the end. You want to put the dowel through the end hole and then put a backstop on to hold it in place. And then you're going to do that same thing for the other side. And now you've got your two gears. You've got the two halves of the linkages. And the last step is we're going to put them all together. If you take your small side of your linkage, you're just going to line it up so that you've got the last open hole for both of them here. Uh, and you're going to take your dowel and you're going to put it through both holes. And then we're going to put a backer on the front and a backer on the back. And that's going to connect them. Um, so when you're connecting this, it's really tempting to want to connect your uh, short popsicle stick directly to the second dowel. If you do that, it's going to prevent your gear from turning. So you really want to make sure you get it on this, you get them both on this last hole. That's going to give you the range of motion that you need for your linkage. And it's going to let your wing move up and down. Misaligned. Let me fix that. One set of flapping bird wings. 
Cool. Thanks to Katie. And thanks to everyone who backed us on Kickstarter. Thanks especially to the Leslie University STEAM team. If you want to support cool projects like this, you can back us on Patreon. Uh, and to find out more about projects like this, such as how we get the materials that we use, uh, you can go to our website at partsandcrafts.org slash make it. Um, and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Uh, links are below for all of those subscription and backing and things. Thank you very much. Great.